man. Today life broke me. I'm feeling a little bit better, but uh, like last year, I came from like New Jersey to, cause my stepdad asked me if I wanted to help him up like a company, a transportation company for for a mattress to deliver mattresses. And I was like, yeah, uh, because we've been wanting to do that for a while. So you know, I left New Jersey where I was born and raised, and uh, uh, you know, I came over here to you know try to do something with a business. And, uh, <laughs> and so I came and ever since, you know, I've been over here. I started off with him and my brother-in-law. We were working like seven days a week, <laughs> not a stop. And I, you know, I bought my truck. It was a box truck, so I could do deliveries. <laughs> and, you know, I've been working my ass off. Uh, you know, he, they purchased it, me and my parents. My parents purchased it, but, you know, I've been paying it off. It, it's like, like yesterday it just like broke down on me it's like for no random reason it just like supposedly the, the engine overheated but it didn't say that it was overheating and you know I changed the oil and everything right and you know I took, I took care of it as best as possible and it died on me and today I find out you know I, I was working in the rain today a borrowed truck and I find out my truck is, is like dead like water is dead but not too long ago like my brakes broke it cost me like six thousand dollars so I had to borrow money from my from my sister because I didn't have it all and the truck used to just it stopped working now like, I kind of earlier I kind of felt better but the more I think about it the more sad I get can't do nothing about it. I just, I just wouldn't be able to pay back my sister, and my mom, my stepdad for the money that they let me borrow. Even though I, I don't even want a truck no more, but I just want to be able to pay them back. And that's how life broke me.